Good morning, everyone. My dear students, please, the one who uses his pen, please, can I turn off the camera there? Hi, teacher. Hi, teacher. Hi, teacher. I am Abdulaziz Alfanto. Yes, I am. I am Ziyad. Yes, Ziyad. I am Ziyad Lebanon. And with all of you, welcome. welcome. Hi. Wait. Wait. Our lesson today is still chapter three, model area. Okay. Okay. But before we start our lesson, we have to go back in the page eight hundred thirty seven, please. Uh, Mr. Mustafa. Yes. What? Yes, do you have your book at the So you got that? You heard me now? The sound is clear? Yeah, yeah. Okay. <laughs> Okay, I mute all. Okay. Has any question? Just raise your hand. You have this option in your. Okay. There is option to raise your hand if you have any question. Okay. I mute all of you. Okay. Okay. In this page, As you see in this page, 837, the distance around a closed figure is called the perimeter. Remember, you have a line homework. Okay, okay, the one who raises his hand, please write your name. Okay, the one who raises his hand, don't write like a code, like a number. Yes, Fahad. Fahad, yes. Do you have a question? That's money. Okay. Okay, guys, the perimeter is the distance around the cloth shape. Okay, yeah. to use a formula for perimeter of root angle, there is you have to multiply length by two and width by two, as you see last one, two times by length plus two times by width. Which this operation for perimeter, I have to circle the fourth one, this one. Okay, as you see here. Okay, this is the formula or the symbol to finding the perimeter of written two times by length plus two times by width. Okay? Okay.
Uh, this for you, please write in chatting the answer for number two, three, four, and five. How to find each perimeter? As we studied last week and Thursday, how to find the perimeter of a rectangle or a square? Okay. Okay. Me chatting, chatting, chatting. The page number already, as you see, is 837. As you see in this your screen, 837. Thanks. Okay. Okay. Can you please solve this? Find each perimeter. Only one answer. Guys, no one talk to each other. Please, this session only for studying math. Who is his, his hand? Yes. Yes, speak. Yes, Abdel. Abdelillah. Yes, Abdelillah. Yeah. Uh, number two. Yeah. Fourteen centimeter. Yes. 14. Yes. Number three. Number three. Yeah. Equal uh, eight. Excellent. Thank you, Abdelillah. What about number four? Number four. Equal. Uh, uh, 24. Yes, excellent. Number five. Number five equal uh, 24. Yes, excellent. Excellent, Abdelila. Thank you, Abdelila. Okay. Now, as your friend said, to find the perimeter, you can add or find the total distance around the shape. As you see here, I have rectangle 5 plus 2, again 5 plus 2 equals 14. Here, 2 plus 2 plus 2 plus 2 becomes 8. Here, I have 6 plus 6 plus 6 plus 6 squared equals 24. Here, I have rectangle 8 plus 4 plus 8 again plus 4 again to be 24. Okay, that we studied in Thursday how to find perimeter how to find the perimeter of a rectangle or a square. Okay? Okay. Now we are going to our... Okay, welcome, 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 welcome all of you. Please, no other chatting. Please, only for the lesson. Now we are going on page 839, our lesson, a model area. Okay? model area for this today lesson a square with a side length of one unit is called a unit square a square with a side length of one unit is called a unit square okay i will let you with this short video what you have, we not yet started about the lesson. Guys, no one speak. Just say, good morning. Yes, okay, I will see it, I will see it. In each part, I will allow you to speak, okay? But let's start with this video. All of you pay attention with this video. Explore, measure, area. If this figure represents one square unit, estimate the area of the shape shown. First, estimate. 
How many square units do you think will cover the side view of the shape? The shape appears to be about 26 square units. Next, trace. Trace one side of the connecting cube onto grid paper. Finally, determine the area. One whole square is one square unit. Each of these is one half square unit. Let's count the number of whole square units. There are 26 whole square units. How many half square units are there? There are two half square units. Since two half square units equal one whole square unit, the total area is about 27 square units. This is one more square unit than our estimate. As you see to find... Explore, measure, area. For any shape, to find the area for any shape, is you have to count how many square units inside the shape to cover it. Okay? Okay, the students who talk more. Okay, here in this lesson, we'll study how to find the area of shape, rectangle or square. Okay, as you see here, the definition of a square with a side length of one unit is called a unit square. A unit square. Be careful about these definitions. Okay? And then, a unit, a unit square has, a unit square has one square unit of area and can be used to measure area. Area means how many squares, okay, how many squares you need to cover this one. See, as you see, the area is what? Area is the, the number of square units needed to cover a figure, okay, without overplaying, okay? As we see here in this, Schedule in uh, this uh, sorry in this table here I have this rectangle how many squares inside it you can count one two three four to find the total is four but before we do this count what about length units the length the length how many uh, length one two three four you write four and how many width only one, so the total will be four. Here, as we see, the sweet guy, please. As we see here, I have here to count how many units for the length. As you see, one, two, three, four. So the length, it will be four. What about the width? Only one. Area means how many square units covered inside? One, two, three, four. So the total is four. Second one, if I count how many for the length, length is one, two, three, four. So the length is four, as you see. What about the width? You can count to the other side. One, two. The width is, is two. What about the area? You can count from inside. How many square inside the shape? How many square units inside the shape? As you see, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, okay? Next one, I have this rectangle. I want the length, you can count from out. As you see, one, two, three, four. So the length is four. And what about width, the other dimension? One, two, 
three, as you see. What about the area? Area, count how many squares inside the shape. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. Okay? Okay. The last shape or the last model we have in the rectangles, what about the length? Length count from out. One, two, three, four, five. As you see, the width, one, two, three. Okay. To find the area, you can count from inside. As you see here, area one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, as you see. Okay? Okay. Okay. I will check if anyone has a question. On 27 shutting. Wait for. You are talking to yourself. Maybe I, what this guy is. It's not a session. Guys, to find the area using this model, just count how many squares are covered the shape. How many squares are covered the shape. Count how many shapes that covered the shape, as you see in the example, okay? See here, area is the number of square units needed to cover a figure, okay? Okay. See next page, uh, in the page number. 841. Please, all of you, can you find the length width for each rectangle? Then find area, as we learned it before. I will explain number one and two, uh, sorry, four and five only. Rectangle, I have to count from out to find the length. One, two, three. So I have three units. For the length. What about width? As it is written here already one. How it's one count from out only one square. Okay, what about the area? Count how many squares cover it from inside. As we see, count from inside one, two, three. So the area will be three. Okay, and then second one. What about the length? Count one, two, three, four. 
So the length will be four. What about the width? Count from other side, one, two, three, four, and five. So the width will be five. What about the area? Area means you have to count how many units square or square units inside the shape. Count one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20. So the area will be 20. Okay, please finish this by yourself. Finish number seven, please. And the number five. The number six, ask you to draw. Six units with length, three units with width, and then find the area. Just you can draw six units and three units, as you see here. See, six units. One, two, three, four, five, six. Repeated this six by three times. One, two, three. Okay. Number six. This is number eight, uh, seven and eight. Yes, Muhammad. We can make uh, net uh, like the, we count the uh, inside. We can multiply the sum with the six. Yes, excellent, Muhammad. Excellent. So this will be our lesson next, inshallah, session. Uh, how to find without counting. This means you have to multiply. As you said, thank you, Muhammad. Excellent. The multiply six times by five equal 30. This will be the, our lesson for next session, inshallah. Thank you for your uh, participation about this. Yes, excellent, Muhammad. We cannot count, only we can multiply. Okay, thank you, Muhammad. Okay, the other thank students you. who make a chatting with themselves, it's too bad that you are doing. I will cancel the chatting next session. It's too bad. This is our lesson or our session for studying math, not for your chatting. Okay? It's not, not good that you are doing. Thank you, Muhammad. Okay, who is his hand? Go up. Okay.
Saif has a question. Yes, Saif. Teacher? Yes. Um, yes, Saif. How can you say we need to multiply? How? This is the, 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 the Muhammad said oh, we cannot count. You can use it but without counting the squares inside, but we can multiply. As you see here in example number five, if you count how many squares inside the shape, can you count this with me? Number five? One, huh? one two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen, twenty. 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20. Yes, as you see, the area is 20. Okay, five times by four equals? 20. It's the same. He, he discovered the rule to find the area without counting. Come multiply the length by the width. Five times by four. Five length by width means the two dimensions for the shape, for the rectangle. Five times by four. Okay? One, okay. Our lesson for, for next session, inshallah. Okay? Okay, teacher. Yeah. Teacher. Yes. Is, there, is there any homework? Yeah, electronic homework in the school website. Okay. Okay, thanks. Okay, Ziad. Yes, Ziad. Abdulaziz. Yes, Abdulaziz. Ziyad Shabanat. What? Ziyad. Is a question? Uh, no. Okay. Because you raise your hand. Okay. Now the, our lesson is already. Yes, safe. It's too easy lesson. Just count from inside how many square units inside the shape. Okay. Okay. Let's go with page. Number 843. Can you do it for yourself, please? 843, number one and two. Can you do it by yourself? Find the area of each rectangle. Write your answer in chatting. Yes, do it now, do it now. Your homework, it will be online homework, SBS, electronic homework. Do it now. There is no homework in your book for today. Do this one now, please. Thanks. Okay, did you answer it? Please write the answer in chatting. See, I'm asking you to write the answer in chatting. You did not. But if you talk to yourself, okay, mini chatting, I will receive. Twenty-two and twenty-four. Yes. Who is this? Say excellent. The same in the website. Yes. Yes. Excellent. Say only one student. He answered. Yes, Rakan Talal. Twenty-two. The first one. What about the second one? Number two.
Okay, your homework for today, SPS, electronic homework. Okay, study hard. Okay, about this lesson and the last lesson. The SPS should be about this lesson and the last lesson, perimeter and model area. Why 36? Not 36. Number two, not 36. Number two is 24. Who said 24? Excellent, excellent. I mean this. Saif said 22 and 24. His answer is wrong. And number one should be you found, Saif, you found the perimeter. I need area. Area means the count inside the shape. Your answer was wrong, Saif. And Rakan also was wrong. Only the second one is right. See, number one, the answer should be 24. 24. As we see, you can count from inside the shape. As we see, you can count from inside. Please count how many square units inside the shape. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, sorry, seven, eight, nine, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21, 22, 23, 24. Otherwise, you come out of by eight times by three, 24. So the answer is should be 24. And second one, I have to count inside or multiply six times six will be 36. So the answer should be 36, second one, and 24. Okay, pay attention, safe. Pay attention, again. Please, all of you to find the area, count inside how many square units inside the shape. That one you found before, say if it was perimeter, 22 and 24. Okay, be careful and pay attention, please, all of you. Okay, many students, they raise their hands. Okay, as you see here. Okay, who raised his hand? Yes, say. Yes, say. Please, is a Ziad. What? Have a question? No. Why you raise your hand? Okay, thanks. And then, uh, Fahad. Yes, uh, Abdul Aziz Fantu. You have a question? Fahad. Abdul Aziz Muhammad raised his hand. Abdul Aziz, you have a question? Yeah. What's your question? Well, do, I, uh, do I just multiply it by three or uh, can I multiply? Yeah, you can do by multiply eight times by three, 24, or six times by six, 36. Or you can count the squares inside the shape. Okay? You have two ways. You okay. can, okay, you can multiply, you can multiply as you see here, eight times by three equal 24, or you can count the square units inside the shape. Okay, Abdul Aziz? Okay. Okay, any question? No. Okay, another one. Yes, Fahad, you have a question, Fahad? No. Okay, why you raise your hand? No more question? Okay, Muhammad, you have a question? Yes, Muhammad. Now, this this tool, it will be in the, uh, the side, the homework. This, not like this. Only uh, like the square units, the definition of area, the definition of perimeter, okay? Study lesson number one and the lesson number 
three to be in the electronic homework, please. Okay. Okay. How how many questions? About five or six, I think. Okay. Okay. Any more question? Thank you, guys. Come on, Ma'am. Come on, Yes. <laughs>